Hi guys, all right, ready for a 10 minute hit? And you ask, how do you make 10 minutes so intense? Well, one way to do that is to make the entire thing for your abs and your core. So that's what I did. So this week's 10 minute is gonna be all abs and that's kind of exciting. So it won't be quite the jumping around sweat fest that uh, you're used to, but you're gonna feel a nice solid burn in your core and that is what we're after. I'm going to just go ahead and go into it and follow along with me, we're not using equipment. So come onto your mat here and you're just going to switch to one side, drop your hip, lift it up, plank, switch, drop, lift, switch. Plank, switch, hip, dips. Say that five times fast. <laughs> That's really hard. You end up saying other things that you shouldn't. I don't have shoes on, but you can certainly do this with shoes on. I just thought because I wasn't jumping around that I would do it kind of yoga style. One second. Okay, the next exercise is for your balance and your muscles are laced in a cross fashion and that's why we do a lot of things opposite hand, opposite foot, or in this case, elbow and knee. So you're in the box position and you're gonna reach and tuck your knee to your elbow and in. Reach, in, reach. And really kind of make that reach every time you're out. Boom, boom. The shoulder of the hand that I'm Standing on is already feeling it. If this is done with deliberate crunch and deliberate reach, you can feel it right away. 10 seconds. Let me do the other side. I felt that. Ah. I love an ab focused workout because you really feel what you're working and it's nice. Fight for that balance. Fifteen seconds, good. Harder than it looks. All right. Be ups. Start on the right side. Put your arm out here so you're braced at your elbow. And we're gonna come up. Wait, Sarah, we just did this for obliques, yes. The last exercise and this exercise are coupled together to really get your transverse abdominis and your obliques. Fifteen seconds. Oh, ha, the burn. Switch sides. Get ready. Notice I'm slightly tipped back on my glute muscles. I'm not on my side, right on my hip bone, because that would be painful. So you can come to your side and just sort of roll back slightly that way 
and then come up so that you're sitting on your glutes and not on your hip bone. 15 seconds. This one is so hard for me, I may not talk much. I have to focus and breathe. Here we go. This is a great um, exercise for stretching your anterior deltoid muscles. I can feel it stretching my shoulders there in the front. Keep your hips pressed up high, glutes held in tight, abs held in tight. I'm shaking. <laughs> I don't know if my voice, if you can hear it in my voice, but I'm shaking. 13 seconds. Keep it up high. Don't let the hips drop. We're going to heels to heaven right after this. Oh, five seconds. Shaky, shaky. Ooh. All right, heels to heaven. We're going to lie back. I like to put my hands underneath my hips for support when I bring my legs down and then you're coming on up. You could also put them out to the side like this or behind your head. You just want to make sure that your hips are coming off. If you have something to brace yourself up here, you can hold and you'll be able to go up even higher. To go up way high. Like this, palms facing down, pointing toward your hips. And you're just going to lift and tuck and out. Tuck. Down to elbows, back up. It's kind of like the um, one that I call knee huggers. When you hug in and lay out and bring it up. But this one I think is a little easier because you can swing your arms for momentum. And this one, it's all, it's all the crunch. Ooh, 10 seconds. Ooh. Okay, flipping over to plank. All right, you're just going to go from hand plank down to elbow plank and back up again over and over, okay? And I try to alternate which elbow I'm leading down with after about three, okay? Come down, up, down, up. up. Okay, now I'm gonna lead with my opposite arm. Down, and you want to be placing your hands exactly where your elbow was. So it stays underneath you. You stay properly stacked up. Four seconds. The whole plank here. Awesome. Just one more, guys. If I did this right, just one more. Let's see. Yes. Okay. Abs are screaming. Legs up. I like to cross my feet, but you don't have to. And you can also hold a, a med ball if you want to. Tap your toes. Bring it down. Oh my gosh. My abs are like, what are you doing? What are you doing, Sarah? You usually rotate through the muscles. Push. 10 
seconds. Push. Ready and activated for tomorrow's workout. See you tomorrow.